16-year-old Parker Schnabel has a new spot to mine. I think my grandpa was kind of saving this area for um, a special time. And I guess this is a special time. Just six weeks ago, Parker finished 11th grade. For his summer vacation, he's taking over the Big Nugget mine from his 91-year-old grandpa, John. He's going to make thousands of dollars every day. But the Big Nugget mine is in trouble. If he doesn't turn a profit, we won't run next year. Already this season, Parker has 10 ounces of gold worth around $16,000. I must be doing something right. But his running costs so far are double that. And the gold has dried up. I've got everything I need, except dirt with gold in it. Parker is desperate to find a new source of gold and save the mine. My grandpa's been talking about all oh, the buckets, the buckets for probably like five years. You know, he's like, oh, if I wanted some easy money, I'd just go dig the buckets out. That's what he kept telling me. So we'll see if he was right. The buckets are part of a 100-year-old dredge a primitive excavator that dug out gold-rich pay dirt. But a flood 100 years ago washed away everything but the heavy iron buckets. The Schnabels think the flood forced the old miners to leave behind a lot of gold. I'm really excited to get the buckets out and see what's down there. And if we're right, it should be pretty good. And if we're wrong, we'll lose 10 grand. Running the 330 excavator, can burn up to $1,000 of diesel a day. John Schnabel has waited 25 years to find out what's under these buckets. Just trying to see what's down underneath there, huh? We live in expectation. <laughs> but he's going to have to wait a little longer. <laughs> 